Agoma has been married to Ikolo for 20 years, but their marriage had been marked by a painful absence, the absence of children. In the Ekute tribe, where women were known for their fertility, Agoma's case was an anomaly. She had never even miscarried, let alone heard the cry of a baby in her home. Ikolo seemed indifferent to the taunts and teases, but Agoma was consumed by the pain of being called barren and a child eater. Desperate to escape the shame, Agoma embarked on a perilous journey to meet Annie, the god of fertility. But she ignored the warning to wait for the designated day after, and instead sought out Annie on the prohibited Nkwo day. There she encountered Isu, the god of sorcery and magic, who offered to grant her desire for a child in exchange for a terrible promise. He would take the child back on the 20th birthday. Agbomma, blinded by her desire, accepted the deal without hesitation. But as the years passed and her daughter Ugumma grew close to her 20th birthday, Agbomma realized the horror of her back game. She turned to Ikulu and together they sought out Ndu, the god of life and posterity, to find a way to protect their daughter. Ndu presented them with a daunting task and a deadly consequence. Death would seem attractive compared to the punishment. Yet, the parents accepted the challenge, willing to face anything to save their child. Ndu gave them a wrist bead to give to Ugumma, warning them that her life depended on it. Now, as Ugumma's 20th birthday approaches, the question looms. What will happen when Isu comes to claim her? You see, uh, you see, don't mind your, your your mother. You know, she is always dramatic. You should know her. Eh? You see, she was angry that I got to the compound before, uh, before her. We started this race from Unko. From Unko. <laughs> she was expecting me to wait for her. But I keep running, keep running. I thought I would get to the compound. So that is why she's uh, she's angry with me. Eh? Don't mind her. You know your mother very well. Eh? <laughs> Mama, is that true? I'm not sick, I'm fine. I was only sleeping. Oh, tell me where. Yes, that is why she's doing like this. That is why she's doing like this. Yes, that was all happened. Hi, my dear. You know that tomorrow is your 20th birthday. Yes. Yes, yes. So. Your father decided to buy you a priceless gift. Hey! You see, uh, Ugum, yes. you know that you are our only daughter. Eh? Your mother and I decided to get you a priceless gift. Eh? Look at it. Eh? This is good bead. Yeah. <laughs> Look, you see this bead? Cost me my only land in this world. Eh? I have to sell it to get this uh, um, this bid for you. Eh? This is priceless gift. You are my only daughter. I can do anything for you. Now nah, have it. Have it. Have it. Uh, you see, Ugo, let me tell you, on no account 
should you remove this bead from your wrist? Eh? It's priceless. Eh? If you know you got to cost you to get this. <laughs> you know I'm your mother. And we love you very much. Even if tomorrow I ask you to give me this gift. Ugo, please don't remove it from your hand. This is the best gift from us to you. We decided let it be costly and priceless yes. for our precious and beautiful daughter. Yes, because you know what it means to sell a whole land to get you this uh, bead. <laughs> I thought, don't worry, don't worry. Eh? Um, talk more to her. Let me, let me uh, go inside and prepare um, um, to garnish something. <laughs> but, but this is too expensive. Not plot of land, the only one he has. Miss Oma, how are you? I'm fine. This is in my side. Um, yes. She's inside. Okay. Hope all is well. Yes. We want to go and fresh water. Oh. oh. We have enough water in the house. Eh? Uh, she cannot go to the stream today. I think she's having her rest. Hmm? Um, Maybe tomorrow she'll go and fetch. Oh, no. I hope everything is okay. Everything is fine. It's the only thing that she's having a rest. Eh? Okay. It's all right. I'll take my leave. Okay. okay. Greet your mom, eh? Hey! But Papa, I'm fine. There's nothing wrong with me. Why would you send me some my way? Uh, well, uh, she has gone. Eh? Uh, maybe tomorrow you can go to the stream with her. But for now, eh? don't worry. Mm? We have enough for time there. And what is it that troubles you? Yes, I'm troubled. I wouldn't like to go mad to go to school with me. That shouldn't be the reason why you're lost in these deep thoughts. Come see. I don't think everything is all right with him. Because I saw her father fetching for a wound in her himself. You did? Yes. This is strange. Anyway, that shouldn't bother you. He's their only daughter. Even though, even though. Let it be now. Uh, that shouldn't bother you.
Caging you, eh? Look, we love you. Whatever we are doing for you is for the love we have for you. Papa, this is where I will disagree with you. You and Mama do not love me because if you love me, you will not be caging me like this. I'm not even free. I'm always, Papa, please. If you... I don't like this now, Mama. You are doing. I don't like it. Hey, come on. no ordinary sickness. The evil spirit that inflicted this sickness is very powerful. Um, Nche, are you saying that there's nothing we can do to save my brother? That there's no remedy that will save him? Of course, we have to try. But I'm afraid that my medicines are not enough to cure him from his sickness. Please. You must do something. Please. At least let us let us try. Let us do something. Please. You of, of course we have to try. But I'm sure that the evil that has befallen him is a bargain from the evil spirit. I came from the evil spirit. Because 
Are you saying that my brother has a bargain with the evil spirit? Is still getting work, but there's no time I will ask this boy something to do, she and you will go and do it. You must waste time. Oh, no, mama. Ah, stop frowning, to be fine. Even though, from what I saw about your parents, they are not getting any better. So, I don't know, did anything happen to them? Mama, I don't know. They were very fine the night before, and then... So, nothing unusual happened to them that you can say, this is what happened to my parents, or this is what I saw? No, I'm not aware of anything. <sighs> what time did you wake up? Um, I, I cannot remember exactly, but I know I woke up very late, because by that time, people that went fishing were already coming back. And did anyone say they had a fight or quarrel with anybody on that particular day. That thing happened. No, Mama, not that I'm aware of. <laughs> My daughter, hmm? your parents must have loved you so much to give you a gift, such an unusual gift. Hmm? My father gave it to me on my 28th birthday and asked me not to take it out, that it is worth more than a piece of land near the Ekute market. I know, that's what I'm saying. It's beautiful. Thank you. You can go inside. I know what to do. Kosi. <laughs> Kosi, get me a cup of water, Ngwal, okay? Get me water! To go to my house. To go and do what? You know that before Mama came to carry me, I, I did not have the opportunity to carry most of my clothes. So I want to go and carry them so I can wear them here. Okay, if then let me escort you. No, Baba, you don't have to. You're busy now. I can. No, don't worry. If I come back, I'll do it Are later. Sure? Yeah, come. Let's go. been able to tell you the solution to my brother's continued illness eh? because we cannot fold our hands and watch him die in the course of this illness my sister-in-law my brother's wife 
has died already. Eh? And my brother is the only one I have. With his daughter. Nobody else. So see a Please. Please. Eh? Uma, your brother's illness and the solution to it lies in the hands of the gods. I'm nothing but a mere messenger. But I must tell you, their situation is not getting any better. Hey! Chubuadju! Hey! Mbano! Mwano wama adju! The gods will speak to you, Dibia. Bikonunu, intercede on our behalf. My brother cannot die in, in, in this illness. Eh? My brother is the only one we have. The only one the daughter has. There's nobody else. Eh? We cannot sit and, and, and watch him die just like that. The same way the wife has died. But no, no, no. Eh? Biko, no, no. Still consult the girls. Maybe they will tell you what to do. The solution to this problem. Eh? I must tell you, I am confused myself. Because in my 20 years as a herbalist, I have encountered this situation only once. And after some inquiries, the victim died. Hey, the victim later died. And after some inquiries, I found out they began with the evil spirit. Chimo! Evil spirit, what? Why? Go and ask your brother a question. There must be something fishy in this kind of condition. I'm telling you out of experience. Go to your house. Let me do something. to see as a Dibia yesterday. And he said to me that he is now tired of treating my brother, your father. That we should come in the next day to carry him to wherever we wanted. Ne, I don't understand. Is he okay now? Where does he want us to take him to? Amam! Amame! I don't know where he wants me to carry my brother to. Am I now a doctor? Or a medicine man? Because I asked him the same question. Dibia, what do you want me to do with my brother as, as sick as this? Where do you want me to take him to? Eh? Hey! Chimo! <laughs> This is the reason I called you. Because I've been thinking, I don't even know how. I don't know, I don't know. I, I called you, mom, to know if you will return to your father's house and clean everywhere so that we can go to Dibia's house and carry your father back to his house. That means you have to stay there to take care of him. On the second thought, I said, okay. Maybe we should bring him back here. And all of us will be here to take care of him. I'm just so confused. I don't know what to say. <laughs> hey! Chimo. Mesoma! Mesoma! Meso! Mesoma! Meso, what? Why are you ignoring me? I've been calling you since. Why would I ignore you? You started ignoring me first. Uh, uh, that, that's not true, Meso. So you know, my parents, oh, they're they are the ones. I don't know what they are hiding me from. I'm sorry. Oh, your parents is hiding you from Knepa, right? I'm not a Knepa. No, that's not what I mean, Meso. So you know you're the only friend I have. I'm sorry. Eh, because it is a lie. You do know what friendship means? 
If I'm your only friend, you will not be running away from me. Miss, I'm not running away from you. The fault is for my parents. I'm sorry, please. And you're the only friend I have now, Biko. Oh, 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 because, Miss, oh, please. No, Miss, I don't want to. I don't Miss, want to. please, no, I'm sorry. No, please, I'm begging you. This food is good. Huh? Yeah. <laughs> this food is good. Now I see reasons why Uso choose this food over his birthright. Hmm? He cannot be blamed at all. Mm -mm. Can't blame him all. <laughs> huh? yeah. Are you sure you are not from the great descendant of um, Jacob? Eh? Yeah. Because this food is good. Hmm? There's something you are not telling me. This food is good though. I'm not regretting having you as my mother. Is you? Eh. Mm -hmm. So all these praises of Jacob Esau is because of this food in your front. Yes. I can see you are very humble because today's own is so, so exceptional. So, if you were Jacob, you will not only sell your birthright, you will even sell human being. Ha! I will sell everything, you know. I will sell the community. And uh, if time is not taken, I will also sell you. But don't worry, I won't sell it because you are a good cook. I will, I will sell it <laughs> Because, 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 go, because, go. Enough, please. Just continue with your food because I can see you are hungry. Okay, hmm? Thank you. Ah, Meanwhile, where's your cousin Goma? Goma, she went to the stream and um, she's not yet back. Ah, she has stayed long now. Here she comes. I was wondering what kept her in the stream. Goma, you're welcome. Yeah, thank you. No, no. Ah. What kept you? We were worried. You needed to see the very big cherry can. They gave me a little girl to fetch your tight, so I had to help her. Oh, Mama, you did well, Oni. No, you no, did well. Goma, she's a good girl. She was raised properly. Yes, properly. I, I thought that by now you would have finished this race. Sorry for yourself. You should be sorry for yourself. 
for yourself. I'm sorry, I didn't. You didn't what? You didn't take it upon yourself to wake up from your slumber and help me with house chores. You are very lazy. You are very, very lazy. Very lazy and stupid. I'm sorry. I said that you're stupid excuse for yourself. I don't want to hide it. Do you know how ungrateful you are? How selfish and wicked you are? You are useless. I regret bringing you to my home. I shouldn't have. But out of love, I choose to do that. But look at how ungrateful and useless you are. Stupid girl. Now, sit back and sit Watch all of them. And let me return meeting them very, very clean. Did you hear me, idiot? Did you hear me? Idiola. Sleep your useless, your life that is already finished away. Idiot. I said you should fit my sister in that I want to make a bubble. Tell you before I left for the market. No, you said I should wash the clothes before you return. So, I said what? I, I, I should finish washing the clothes. Okay, put the clothes in the bucket. Huh? Put clothes, there's no clothes in the bucket. Put clothes in the bucket to go ma. Put clothes on the sun. Now I broke my hands this woman. What am I going to say to her? Everyone is even to sleep myself. Every time I've been shooting, I've been shooting. Since I turned 20, everything has just been going inside. Look at me. Am I the first person to turn 20? Me, I'm tired. Oh. Ah! Oh, but why did I turn 20? Please just tell me why I turned 20. Why did I turn 20? Everything is going so bad. Ever since I turned 20, everything is sad. I'm not the first to do it. I'm not the first to do it. I'm broken my hands. I'm not the first to do it. Oh my God! I'm not the first. I will stand by and watch you mistreat her. Miss you did. Yes. So are you blind to see that this your stupid cousin is cursed? No, if she is I'm not cursed, where is the water that asked her to go and fetch for me? No, calm down. Where is the water? Calm down. This your attitude just changed all of a sudden. My attitude will not change. Just because I have started to see the truth. 
does not mean that my attitude changed. And if you question me too much, I will start with you. I will make you to see that my attitude did not change. This girl is cursed. Open your eyes and see that she's cursed. You are cursed. Hey, you are cursed. She's not cursed. <laughs> Is auntie around? No, my auntie is not around. And my brother Kosi, he just stepped out not quite long. Okay. I came to deliver a message for him. So what message is that? And this one is for the women's meeting. Please help me to give it and keep it away from me. Okay, auntie. Okay. And um, auntie, bye bye. Okay, auntie. Okay. to keep for you. Okay, gotcha. Said you... <laughs> I don't understand. You said you misplaced the money. Njideka gave you a few hours to give to me. How? What happened to the money? I don't know. You don't know? Who was with you when we left? Nobody. I was the only one at home. You were alone in this house. And the money Njideka gave you a few hours ago got missing. And you don't know what happened to it. Why now? Just look at you. Of all the profession to choose in this whole world, it is the art of lying and stealing that you choose. Eh? I'm not lying. You're not lying. Anyway, nobody called you a liar. I did not. But they gave you money. And you were alone in this house. And suddenly, this money flew away from my house into your pocket. And you don't know where it is. See, that money, belongs to Intezi Women's Meeting and they will be needing it by next month. So I don't want to know how the money got missing, how it flew away. Whether you choose to steal it or not, I don't care. All I know, by next month, by the end of next month, make that money available. How you will do it doesn't concern me. Just provide that money so I will quietly give to them. Did you hear me? Why are you still crying? Did I beat you? No. Did I call you a thief? No. But you're a thief now. No. You're a thief. You stole my money. No. Hey! You stole my money. Stop. 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 Good day, ma. Ah, good day, ma. Yeah. Yes, ma. I was actually on my way coming to your house. I hope there is no problem. No, ma. Uh, there is no problem, ma. Um, ma, please, I wanted to ask. If you had any work on your farmland, I can help you and work. Of course I do. Hey. I do have work. Um, so you are ready to work? Ah, I'm not doing anything. I'm ready to work. Uh, but I can only pay you 2000 That is what I can afford. Oh, okay, ma, no problem. All right. Make sure you come tomorrow so that I will show you the farmland. Okay, eh? ma. Thank you, ma. All right, Thank my you, dear. Thank you very much. Bye -bye. Bye -bye. Bye -bye. Hey.
what happened? Why are you looking like a mad woman? <coughs> Go my talk. Why are you looking like a mad woman? What happened? <laughs> I went to I went to the farm to work so that I can replace Mama's money that I misplaced. <laughs> Mama has been going and she said that if I don't replace her money, she'll kill me. Mama won't kill you. Oh my god. Stop crying. This money will see it. You see it. Stop crying. Stop crying. How much is the money, sir? Stop crying. I don't know. She said my name was going to finish me. I'm going to be walking in the map. Oh, my voice is crashing me. I don't know. Oh, God. What happened? Mama just changed all of a sudden. This, this is not my mom. She was not like this. I'm sorry. No. I'm done. I'm sorry. Stop crying. It's not you're going to replace the money. This is even working like a bad man in the farm. I know. Sorry, you won't replace it. But I will try. We'll find the money. Stop crying. Stop crying. Oh, oh my child, I'm fine, girl. Stop crying. I've actually been looking for you. I wanted to apologize for everything. It's okay. I'm sorry too. But wait, why are you washing your hands to this early morning? Um, I've been working. I'm trying to replace my auntie's money that I misplaced. That's why. But when will the auntie be allowing me to do this one more? It was a mistake that you lost the money. Doing this one work is out of wickedness. Hey, but Meso, what do you want her to do, eh? What do you want her to do? It's my fault. I misplaced the money. Are you expecting her to go and work for the money that I misplaced? I have to pay for what I did. And sometimes I really think I'm cursed too. Uh, because uh, everything I, I go, touch go, doesn't go, stop this. Work. Stop it. Go, stop assuming things. Okay? <laughs> Life is never a bed of roses. Bless me. I know that life is never a bed of roses. I know that life is never a bed of roses. But my case is different. Isn't you don't good? understand. Everything I touch does not work out at all. It's, it's as if I'm a destroyer. Eh? Everything I, I lay my hands on, it doesn't always work out. Oh, stop this. Hmm? I'm tired though. I'm, I'm tired. I don't know what to do. Eh, eh. Now that I remember, do you know anything about beads? Especially this one that I'm wearing. Oh. I don't know, but this beauty is beautiful. Um, you know, I wish my parents would give me something like this. Hey, don't worry. Your parents will give you something like this, okay? <laughs> like, I'm so happy to see you. Okay. Okay. How are you now? Okay. Hey, okay. I miss you. Time. And yeah, I thought I would not have a friend anymore. Aww. You have me with you now. Hi.
your house so I can take you to your house. No. You don't have to take me to my house. I am fine. I don't need your help. My friends will come and take me. Are you sure you don't need my help? You know human beings are not to be trusted. What if your friends don't show up? I can take care of myself. You can take care of yourself with this leg. I am fine by myself. My friends will come. Don't worry about Sorry about you. You can go now. Are you sure I can leave you here? I don't mind though. You can go now. I, I don't mind helping you to your house. Go away. Well. see my friends. I've been waiting. And sadly, it's getting dark. You see, I told you human beings disappoint that they are not to be trusted. Or you said your friends are different, that they will come for you now. So what would you have me do now? I mean, it's so obvious I don't even have a choice. I'll take you to my parents' house. The Havalis is tending to them, so there you can rest for the night. You can do that. Go on.
Welcome to my father's house. Here, you're going to be staying for the meantime till you get better. And then, when you're better, I'll help you look for your friends, okay? That is okay. And maybe someday I will repay you for your kindness. No, that will not be necessary. There's no need to repay me. After all, I'm only helping somebody that needs help, okay? Let's not forget, you need to go inside and relax, okay? I'll come back and see you tomorrow. Should I help you inside or you can help yourself? No, I can help myself. Are you sure? I don't need your help. Okay, no problem. Sorry, so I'll take my leave now. Go well. Take care, I'll see you tomorrow. My food. Your food? Yes. Let me see. Your food, you're taking it to where? I'm taking it to the farm. I've not eaten this one. So that I won't be able to at the farm. So I'll eat it at the farm. So. This food. You are taking this food to the farm as lunch. Is this food not enough to feed the whole family? Will this food not be enough for the whole family? No, I not clear. Eh? I have not eaten this morning. That's why I'm taking that quantity so that I can eat when I'm done with work at the farm. You must be very stupid. Very crazy to think like that. How can a small girl like you be eating this much? Do you know what it takes me to provide money for, for, for our feeding? Have you not given me shishi for food in this house? And you want to be eating this quantity of food? Only, only you. In a zori? Eh? Now tell me the truth. Who are you taking this food to? Because you cannot just be you. Koyan Wenia, who are you taking it to? Eh? Mama, I'm not taking the food to anybody. It's for myself. Koyan Wenia. And meanwhile, you are going to the farm. I don't have any farm tools with you except my food. Eh? Ngoma. Mama. You will not eat a that you will not eat a spoon in this food. In the blue way. Oh, I'm off ya. Idiot. But you can't take the farm too and go to the farm. Come on, take the farm for man. So I said don't take my farm too. I'm off ya. Where is your farm tools? Be gentle. You're hurting me. I'm trying my best to be as gentle as I can be, okay? Sorry. Sorry. Yes, now that I remember, did you take your medicine yesterday? Oh, that. I did. It was very bitter. And it, it almost purged me. Sorry. But you know it's for your own good. You need to take it so that you get better. That is all right. I brought some food for you. Yes, I did. It's inside. So when I'm done here, you eat. You did well. Um. Could you remind me your name? I've forgotten that. My name is Ugoma. I I need to get going before the sun sets. I have some work I've not yet finished at the farmland. And I wouldn't want my, my father's sister to quarrel. OK? 
Okay, so when I'm done here, I'll get going. That's okay. So the mama just changed. The way she treats Ugoma. Very bad. She was never like this. Sitting now and looking like this. You will not understand. Hmm. So, um, by the way, how was the um, land? What did you do? Well, it was stressful as usual, but I'm trying my best. Did I tell you that our mama found the money? Found the money. Which money? The missing money now. You mean, when did she find the money? Yesterday. Yesterday. Eh, hey, but I gave Mama some money this morning before leaving for the farm. And she did not mention anything about her finding any money to me. So I don't understand. <laughs> I'm shouting. So now I'm shouting. Oh, you are dancing at the logo. We're not shouting. Anyway, there's no problem. I don't know the kind of stupid business I'm doing with you. Why is nothing going on on that farm? There is no work going on there. What is happening? I paid you to work on my farmland, and nothing serious is going on there. What is happening? You see the reason I said that I don't know if you, if you have gone mad. Because I'm not mad at Papa Goy. You walked into my house to accuse me that you paid me to work on your farm. Why you did not? Did you pay me to work in your farm? Did you give me any money to work to, to clear your farmland? The answer is no. You just paid my niece to clear your farmland. And this morning, she told me that she's coming to Uzo's farm. That she's going to Uzo's farm to clear the farmland. This is the third day. And nothing serious is going on in that farm. Nothing is being done in that farm. She is nowhere to be found. What is going on? What is all this? Did I make a mistake where we tell her? And what, and what is the problem? That's what you should have kindly come to tell me or say. Instead of shouting that you paid me because you did not. She told me this morning that she, she has gone to the farm, to your farm to clear the land. And that's what I believe. So if she's not on your farm, where is she now? Ah, ah, you should know better. Why are you asking me? In Ajum? Belgoma. Ebe Kisi. Ebe Kisi, where are you coming from? Which stupid farm? Is it the same farm that I'm coming from? She's not coming from any farm. Ebe Kisi. Where are you coming from? You are stammering. Why are you stammering? Um, I, I went to the farm, but I left early. Hey, you went to the farm and you left early? You must go to Onye farm. You must go to the farm. You left Martin. You must go to the Oh, you went to the farm and you left early to your man's house and allowed Uzo to come and insult me in my house for doing nothing. Okay? Anyway, that is none of my business. All I know is that you should go and work on that farm. Don't hide that you should go and work on that farm. Don't refer to me because if you refer to me, you will not have that farm like Claire. If you refer to me, you will not have that farm like Claire. Did you give me any money? Huh? Because I 
because of it, people are coming to talk now. Say, come inside. Keep that hole. Keep that hole. Go inside also. Are you driving? Are told you we use it to send the dead people to the afterlife. I'll keep it there. Okay, um, please, you need to get ready to leave tomorrow. I don't want my auntie to meet you here. That is okay. I'm so dead. I don't want to lose my parents here. All I have. I'm so scared. Okay. I don't want to lose my parents here. Everything I have. My life is useless without them. I need them. inside what are you doing inside that you will not bring out yourself so that we can see what will become of your father my brother eh? I am here worried of what to do you need a pancake Ugama what is it what are you, what are you dressing inside You've not even bothered to come and ask me, what are we going to do? How are we going to manage to, 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 to bring your father 
back, back to here, yeah? or even to his house. No, never let the pancake. You still have time to put lipstick on your mouth, foolish girl. Your father is sick and dying. I left him here sick to go and get this house for him to drink. Everything is not alright. Hey, something isn't right. Everything is right, <laughs> Dibia. Everything you are seeing here is right. Because the most important thing is my brother is healthy and alright. Ghost of our land, is this real? Is this happening? My brother, we, you just came to take your sick body home. And here you are, well and healthy. Is this happening? I wish my wife was better. 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 I Hey, I can't. Hey, hey, 
Bye. 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 Bye.